When I first start teaching body targeting, I start with the front end of the body. And for that, you wanna make sure that you have really good handheld targeting behaviors in place. So first, make sure that you've worked on this and your horse knows to touch the target with their nose wherever you hold the target, whether it be out to the side, out to the front of them so they have to step forward to touch it, or even holding it up high, sort of above their nose. Um, so they'll orient up high to touch the target also. Your next step is to transfer from the handheld target to your hand. So here I'm asking for a cheek target. I hold up my hand just next to her cheek and the target at the same time in a position that requires her to move around so that she kind of runs into my hand as she's going to touch the target. As soon as her cheek touches my hand, I click and reward that. So I'm clicking and treating her before she gets to touch the handheld target so I can start to fade that out. So next I ask for a neck target, same thing, but she's got to move a little bit more, her, uh, move her whole body over a little bit more toward the handheld target in order to run into my hand with her neck. So she's actually taking a step toward me. And again, I'm clicking and treating her for when her neck makes contact with the palm of my hand and not when she's actually touching the handheld target. So I can begin to fade that out. Just think of the handheld target as being an assistant to help guide her to, toward your hand. I'm now working on her shoulder and asking for a shoulder target. Next, we work a little bit on eye targeting and ear targeting, just to show you how that might look. So again, just hovering my hand over the body part that I want her to push into the palm of my hand, and then using the handheld target to direct her head toward my hand and clicking for when that body part touches my hand. Now I'm gonna show you teaching her a new behavior that she doesn't know, which is targeting her chest into my hand which requires her to move forward into my hand, take a step forward into my hand. When I first started uh, asking for this, she was lifting her leg up and holding her leg in the air. Um, she was just confused about what it is that I wanted. So I just wanted to show you how I work through this. So she continues to hold her leg. I'm just ignoring that, I'm holding my hand near her chest, and I'm using the handheld target to guide her forward. And when she gets it right, when she uh, walks into my hand with her chest, I'm clicking and treating and then starting over. It takes her um, just a couple of minutes to, re to understand that the behavior I'm asking for is to move into my hand with her chest and to stop lifting her leg. But it really doesn't take that long for her to learn that. So I wanted just to show you that process.
And then you can see on this final repetition, she actually moved into my hand without lifting her leg. So we ended the session on a really good note and gave her a jackpot.